Bullets flying and one man hospitalized after a shootout in Saginaw. Thanks for watching the news at six. I'm David Custer in our Flint studio and I'm Meg McLeod. First responders say they found more than 100 shell casings. TV 5's Raven Blue spoke with a local business owner who says despite the scary scene, he's staying put. It was almost like the OK Corral early Friday morning in Old Town Saginaw, a shooting believed to be between two groups near the corner of Hamilton and Court Streets left one person shot and more than 100 shell casings on the ground. In an area the city is working to transform and revitalize, especially after the pandemic. For Mitch Del Meester, owner of The Bread Guy, he hopes this incident will not deter people from visiting Old Town. It's unfortunate. I would rather that doesn't happen. Um, ultimately, I'm, I'm here because I believe that Saginaw has a lot of potential growth. And that was really what drew me to the area was that we could make a difference here. Saginaw Police and Michigan State Police responded to the scene around 1 a.m. Friday. Police say one person was shot in the leg and was taken to a local hospital by personal vehicle. The victim is in good condition. I hope that people are still willing to come. Del Meester says incidents like this are out of his control, so he will compromise and focus on what he can. A lot of it is out of our control. Um, I just, I can't control, you know, what happened out there this morning. That's really unfortunate. Um, what we can control is just having the best atmosphere inside of our little building. Michigan State Police says there were no witnesses and the victim is being uncooperative. In Saginaw, Raven Blue, WNEM TV5. That shooting remains under investigation. If you have any information, call police.